Nestled in the tourist corridor is the iDrive Grand Resorts and Suites on Kirkman Road. And while there's nothing remarkable looking about it, the state says during Hurricane Matthew, the hotel charged some remarkably high rates. So high, the Attorney General's office has filed a lawsuit against the hotel alleging price gouging. The lawsuit says in October 2016, when Hurricane Matthews, life-threatening winds forced over a million people to evacuate. The price of a room at the hotel tripled from $32 to $96 a night. The lawsuit says some people were hit even harder, charged close to five times the going rate, $170 a night. The lawsuit says that's a price hike of 428 percent. We were in a hotel and we had previously paid the rate of $50, but during the hurricane, they increased the rate to $150. Brandon Coburn knows the feeling, says during Hurricane Irma, he was the victim of price gouging as his family struggled to find a place to stay while vacationing here from Tennessee. If someone is in need during a hurricane, and you raise your prices because you know people need to get out of the storm, I think I don't think that's good. That's bad. Now, according to the lawsuit, the hotel can be fined up to $1,000 for each complaint, and there are 48 of them. Now, I have reached out to the hotel to get their side of the story, and I have not heard back from them yet. Live in Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.